So Valentine's Day weekend, we did the L bomb, the love bomb, and we set a goal of $50,000, and we thought that was a really big goal. We weren't sure if that was the goal that we should set, but it was what we had on our heart. So we started it Saturday morning with people being able to go online and make their donations. And by that evening, around 6, 6.30, we were around 6,000, 7,000. And at Calvary, when the service, uh, when they took up the offering, by the end of the service, we were already over 20,000. It was just incredible. With Reload Love, it's an opportunity for individuals, people that think that, what, on, what could I do? I'm just one person. I only, you know, I only have a little bit of money. I can't make a huge impact. But what the love bomb showed us and showed others is that one action, whether a dollar or twenty dollars or ten thousand um, dollars, made a huge impact. And it not only impacted our team of the outpour and the response that so many people had, but us, our team, watching others be moved by the action and watching the Lord provide our staff, uh, the accounting staff, they were moved to tears of just the outpour that came. And then that whole weekend, again, just individuals, we were constantly online watching, hitting refresh, watching the, um, the, the thermometer just increase to more, another thousand, another hundred. We couldn't even keep up with it whenever we were trying to post it online and keeping everyone uh, up to date with what was going on. And so we just want to thank you. We want to thank you, our donors, those of you that have chosen to join the Love Mint. Your impact is making a difference and we can't do this without you. There are so many children being terrorized and they need our help. And for those of you that aren't sure, um, please go to our website, reloadlove.com. You can learn more and um, try it. Give one donation and see what happens. Thank you so much. We are an army of love. We fight for those who are weak. Yeah. We are an army of love. Whoa. We shout for those.